Welcome to Wednesday Morning Prayer on this Australia Day. Rejoice always, pray without ceasing, in everything give thanks, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus. Glory to God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and for ever. Amen. A song of God's grace. Blessed are you, the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, for you have blessed us in Christ Jesus with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places. You chose us to be yours in Christ before the foundation of the world, that we should be holy and blameless before you. In love you destined us to be your children, through Jesus Christ, according to the purpose of your will, to the praise of your glorious grace, which you freely bestowed on us in the Beloved. The night has passed, and the day lies open before us. Let us pray with one heart and mind. As we rejoice in the gift of this new day, so may the light of your presence, O God, set our hearts on fire with love for you, now and for ever. Amen. The psalm today is a portion of Psalm 145, verses 1 to 9. It begins, I will exalt you, O God, my King. I will bless your name forever and ever. Every day will I bless you and praise your name forever and ever. You may wish to pause the video here to complete the remainder of the psalm. We consecrate this day to your service, O Lord. May all our thoughts, words and actions be well-pleasing to you and serve the good of our brothers and sisters. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. The reading today is from Mark chapter 12, verses 13 to 17. It begins, Then they sent to Jesus some Pharisees and some Herodians, to trap him in what he said. You may wish to pause the video here to complete the remainder of the reading. May your word live in us and bear much fruit to your glory. The Canticle to Deum Laudamus. We praise you, O God. We acclaim you as Lord. All creation worships you, the Father everlasting. To you, all angels, all the powers of heaven, the cherubim and seraphim sing in endless praise. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of power and might, heaven and earth are full of your glory. The glory of company of apostles praise you. The noble fellowship of prophets praise you. The white-robed army of martyrs praise you. Throughout the world, the Holy Church acclaims you. Father of majesty unbounded, your true and only Son, worthy of all praise, the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, you Christ are the King of glory, the eternal Son of the Father. When you took our flesh to set us free, you humbly chose the virgin's womb, you overcame the sting of death, and open the kingdom of heaven to all believers. You are seated at God's right hand in glory. We believe that you will come to be our judge. Come then, Lord, and help your people, bought with the price of your own blood, and bring us with your saints to glory everlasting. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. 
Amen. A Collect for Australia Day Bounteous God, we give you thanks for this ancient and beautiful land, a land of despair and hope, a land of wealth and abundant harvests, a land of fire, drought and flood. We pray that your spirit may continue to move in this land and bring forgiveness, reconciliation and an end to all injustice. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. You may wish to pause the video here to say intercessions, thanksgivings and prayers. Eternal God and Father, by whose power we are created and by whose love we are redeemed. Guide and strengthen us by your Spirit, that we may give ourselves to your service and live this day in love to one another and to you. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you and also with you. Let us praise the Lord. Thanks be to God. May the God of steadfastness and encouragement grant us to live in such harmony with one another, in accord with Christ Jesus, that we may with one voice glorify our God and Father. Amen. <laughs>